Oh, sorry, I was just stretching there. I got a comment on one of my um, previous videos asking how to make a YouTube intro. I'm going to show you. Basically, I'm doing mine in Final Cut Pro. Um, you can also do it in iMovie, but it doesn't have as many options. So if you don't have Final Cut Pro, you can get it on the App Store, um, which is where I got mine, But or you can get it free. Um, uh, it's not what I did, but you can, I'm not really, you know, I, I think you should buy it to support Final Cut Pro, but, you know, if, if you're cheap and you just want to, you know, well then, you know. So this is the one that was on my recent video. Here we go. I'm just going to play it. So that is my YouTube intro right now. So basically, go to um, your projects and click this little plus button here and just call it intro. I'm going to call mine intro tutorial. Um, so yeah, so click custom here, 10, 1080p HD, 1920 by 1080 and uh, 60. Uh, surround, you want surround, not stereo, and it should be good. There you go. Click OK. And now this, I the song that I use in mine is called Passion Pit. Um, yeah, so just so that yeah, that's just what I used. You can use any song you want, but now on to the actual intro. Click on this T and go into I think it no credit nope is it this one yes so um i'm going to show you how to do no i'll i'll just do the one that i used um it's called splash ink splats what's that one oh okay so click it and drag it into here so there you go this is what you have right now nothing nothing crazy you just got your uh your stuff there and this is where you will enter your text all right oh there we go so click title so for me i did mr jack plays and it'll automatically change the colors for you and then you don't need to do a subtitle for this, I won't do a subtitle, but for my intro, I have um, I just have gaming and tutorials. So if you play that, now this is what it looks like. <laughs> Mr. Jack plays. Alright, perfect. So now to adding your music. So, Passion Pit, here we go. You're gonna drag it under and drag it so that it just fits there. And now you're gonna want it to you're gonna want to just right click here or just no, nope, never mind, click it. Click blade and cut it right before. There. Then go back to the select tool and delete it. So now, what you have is this. <laughs> but it just cut off right there. And I don't know if you noticed, but in mine, I had it kind of fade away. So just put your cursor over and grab this and drag it back to just after that little, those little yellow things. 
so that it basically just makes the volume fade out. So what you got now? <laughs> And there you have it. So now, just export it, or hmm. maybe you don't. Oh no, share, and then export movie. So what you're going to want to do, so preview it there. Um, uh, current settings. Um, after export, you want it to open with QuickTime Player. Um, include video and audio. Make sure that's clicked. I used to never have that clicked, and I was like, man, what is going on? There's no sound. Make sure it has video and audio. Click Next. Intro tutorial. Save it to your desktop. And save. It'll just export real quick. It should go fairly quickly, unless your internet's quite so... Actually, it might go faster than this because my internet's quite slow right now. It should just take about five seconds-ish. That's what it used to do for me when I made my first intro. My first intro, I made an iMovie. And it was absolutely horrible. Like, oh my goodness. I look back on it now, like to my some of my first videos. Oh, and I, I major face pump all over my face. I just, oh, I, I didn't like it. So, three seconds, minimize the shenanigans, and uh, what? Hmm. <laughs> oh, there it is. All right. So now you can watch, make it go big screen, and bam. And what I do is I use um, ScreenFlow to edit my videos, and I also use it to record my videos. But, um, um, yeah, I just do a cross-dissolve thing at the end of those videos, and then it just kind of blends perfectly into the video. Hope you enjoyed that, guys, and I will see you in the next episode. Er, I don't know if it's going to be an episode or not. I don't know if it's going to be a tutorial. Depends. All right, see you later. Bye-bye.